everybody and welcome back to a plan with me video today we are working on monday september 5th through sunday september 11. sorry about the nasaliness in my voice i'm super sick I was actually planning on filming this last night, but I actually went to bed like super, super early because I took a half day at work and I slept through the entire thing. Like I just woke up and it's five o'clock in the morning. So I have to get this done because I'm going out of town this weekend. Um, actually, before we do this, let's look at last week. So here is last week and here is yesterday. This is me being sick. I was gonna be doing a planning session and I needed to get that done because tonight I am going out of town so I'm filming it today and we're gonna upload or not upload but edit today and then get this up for you guys on Monday because I will still be out of town on Monday so I did want to recap I did have some fun things that happened this week so um, as I wanted to say I did have a date we're gonna go into that as I do the plan with me because it's a story but it's a good story um, and I started looking at new apartments last week and I got to sign a new lease on a new apartment. So I will be moving. Um, I apologize for telling you guys that I was gonna like start doing all of these like home improvement projects around my own apartment. Um, honestly, the reason I'm moving, there's many reasons, but um, the rent is too high for like the market that I'm in. And I don't need as much space as I currently have. So that's like the main reasons why I'm moving. Because I mean, who doesn't want to save a little bit of money every month? And then also, like, I never really felt super at home in this apartment unit. Like, I don't know why, but I never really felt, like, connected to it. I know that's kind of crazy because it's obviously not mine, but whatever. So, yeah, um... I'm moving and it's gonna be awesome, but I'm not moving until October. So you will um, see all of those shenanigans in October. Okay, so we need to put in all of the things this week. Oh my goodness. I'm sorry for all the sniffles like in advance, you guys. Uh, oh, so many sniffles, so many sniffles. Okay. So let's do this. Um, so I'm still gonna be in Minnesota on this day, on Monday, but I need to like go home at some point. So I'll just kinda put this in the middle of my day. I don't really know when I'm going home, but I like to get an early start if I can on days that I have to, you know, drive or whatever. So I don't know, it takes me about three to four hours to drive it. Okay, so let's see. I was a good girl again and I pulled out some of the things that I'm going to be using. So that's always a good sign. But I know I sound really, really weird right now, but I actually feel so much better. Like, so, so much better. All right, so, oh, and the washi I'm gonna use this week, I am like so out of it, you guys, that I'm just gonna use some I don't know, some this washi, I don't know, it's like multicolored, and then I'm using this like navy that kind of goes with this like little navy petal on here. I don't know. I'm pretty sure they're both from Hobby Lobby, but I don't know, I'm not 100% sure. The reason I'm using this is because I can just use whatever and not even really have to think about it because I can't think today. I'm still probably hopped up on a bunch of cold medicine, so yeah. <laughs> All right, so back to Fargo. Oh. So let me tell you guys about the date. So we met at Caribou, which if you guys don't live in the Midwest, I don't know where they have Caribous all over the place. Um, we, it, okay, so Caribou is Caribou coffee, but it's, it's like Starbucks, but it's not Starbucks. I don't know, I don't drink coffee. I mean, I know that's kind of crazy to be like a planner girl and not drink coffee, but whatever. So yeah, we met there. He ran a little bit late because he, he says he got like, cornered by his boss before he left and thought it was gonna be like a five minute conversation and it turned out to be like a 25 minute conversation about something, I, I don't know what. Anyway, that was fine. I was already there when he had uh, like messaged me through like the dating app. Like we don't have each other's phone numbers. Like it's just like all the dating app. So anyway, I was like, yeah, that's no problem. He was only like five minutes late, so it wasn't a big deal. So anyway, um. He comes and says hello, like I had already ordered my smoothie that I per that I had purchased. And so he seemed kind of disappointed that I had already ordered because he's like, well, I wanted to buy you a coffee. I'm like, well, it's okay, I don't drink coffee. It took me a while to figure out what I actually wanted to drink here, blah, blah, blah. 
So he's like, oh, okay. He's like, sorry, I didn't know. I'm like, no, that's okay. I'm like, when I explain to people that I don't drink coffee, then people are like, what? You don't drink coffee? Coffee just makes me like really sick. So it's just not great for my digestive tract. I'll just put it that way. Um, so that is why I don't drink coffee. Um, but I do drink tea, but it was later in the evening. It was like 6.30 or so when we met up. So I did not want any caffeine because I would have been like up all freaking night and we don't need that. So anyway, we hung out, had a really good conversation. Um, felt like it went well. He is very much like a numbers nerd, which is good. Um, works for an insurance company, which I already knew that. So the conversation seemed to like flow pretty well, I think, um, in, in my own opinion. I mean, I don't know what his opinion was of it. Um, he knows that I am out of town this weekend, which you guys aren't seeing this till Monday, but I'm talking about like the weekend previous. And then he is actually in Bismarck the next weekend. And then I have friends coming into town for a concert on Friday night. And then they're going to be in town probably until Sunday morning. So yeah, so he's like, I don't know when we can get together again. You're always so busy. And I was like, well, yeah, I know. Like you can just, I'm like, we can make it work. Like I'm sometimes available in the evenings, but um, you know, just, just let me know what you're thinking. And I did say to him, like, this is my own, like, issue like I've got problems but you guys probably know this if you watch my videos so when I'm dating like the first couple of dates I don't follow up on those dates I have the mentality that if you want to see me you'll make it a point to see me like you can message me on the dating app and then I will either ignore you or I will say yeah let's go out again okay um, I don't know why but I've always been that way like always and you know I think that's okay I, I like that's my only like weird like kind of girly thing that I do so yeah I don't know I'm just kind of odd in that way but I did tell him up front like this is how I am like I will you will not be seeing a message from me and I'm like and it's not because I don't like you it's because if you want to make this happen you have to make it happen I'm like I I just don't um, follow up on first dates or sometimes even second or third dates after that then I feel comfortable enough to actually like not put myself out there that's like the kind of the bad thing to say but you know like if you want to if you want to see me bad enough like you'll just make it happen so sorry to be redundant oh in, in the course of doing that I totally messed this up okay so he's like oh okay I understand you know no problem he's like well I'll be sending you a message I just don't know when blah 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 so I don't I mean, I haven't checked this morning, but I'm pretty sure he hasn't messaged me back yet. Pretty much because, you know, I don't know if we're going to go out again. Um, that's, like I said, that's up to him, not me. But also, I, um, I'm out of, or I'm out of town, he's out of town, so whatever. We'll figure it out. But I'll let you guys know if we end up meeting up again. I mean, he was a nice guy, and I would definitely go out with him again. It's just a matter of him pulling the trigger on it, not me. So, yeah. I know a lot of you were curious on Instagram how it went, so I figured I had to had to recap it in this video. Oh, and by the way, like as the date was wearing on, I was getting like sicker and sicker and sicker, and I didn't like sound super horrible until like early Thursday morning, which was kind of nice because the, the the date happened on a Wednesday. But yeah, anyway, what do you do? Okay. So I have a dentist appointment on my, or sorry, on Wednesday. I need to put this in. Ugh. Like, can I just not go to the dentist? Is that like a possibility? I'm pretty sure it should be. All right, so Smile Solutions at 2 p.m. I'm just realizing like none of my stuff is matching today, but I like legit don't even care right now. So I need to do a little, don't forget, I don't want to go, so I'm putting that in. Okay, and I absolutely hate writing on Wednesdays, but we're going to have to write. Don't forget my guard. I have to bring my guard. So I think we are good to go. All right, so that is done. Okay, so all my work is done. Work, 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 work. We are done with work, work, work. 
All right, um, oh, I have to work my other job probably on Sunday. The schedule is not up, but I'm just gonna put it out anyways because I tend to always work on Sundays if I'm available. So we're gonna do 11.30 to 6.30. That's like the only shift on Sundays, which is kind of nice that I already know this. So yeah, and my friend's gonna be in town, but she usually leaves pretty early on Sunday mornings, so I'm not too worried about that. Little bow tie there, cute little thing. Um, okay, and then another really fun thing that's happening on Friday is Friday night, we are going to the Ludacris concert, which I'm like super pumped up about. And like, I can't like brain today at all. So I'm gonna use some Chrissy and Designs because that stuff's just like so functional and easy. Oh crap, I gotta do laundry at some point. Ugh. Let's do laundry on Sunday, I think. That'll be a good day to do laundry. Okay, I'll just put that up there, whatever. Okay, so, all right. I can't believe Ludacris is coming to Fargo, you guys. Like, that's pretty amazing. Um, it's also kind of hilarious. I'm very looking forward to actually who shows up to the Ludacris concert that lives in Fargo. Um, yeah, oh, crud. And I forgot to take out this Richmond thing. Okay, I need to take this out as well. I also need to do some editing this week, but I'm honestly, I don't know what day I'm gonna do it on yet, so I'm probably not gonna put that in today, just because I don't know. Um, I've already got my Wednesday video already uploaded and scheduled for you guys, so that will be good, um, but I'm just really not sure when I'm gonna be doing editing of other stuff, because Friday is gonna be my state fair vlog for you guys, so like what I did this past weekend that hasn't actually happened yet per me filming this. Okay, so there we go. All right, and if you guys are ever interested in what I use, this is called Undo. I have a link um, to Amazon below for you guys if you're ever interested in getting this. This stuff is amazing if you put down something and you need to lift it back up. A lot of the like planner stickers, you, if you put them down, you can usually lift them right back up like in a second, but unfortunately, you know, if you've had them in there for a while, like I've had that one in there for a while, it's difficult to do without actually ripping the page. And um, this is almost completely dry. I wanna put down here that um, Amanda and um, her daughter Olivia are gonna be in town. So I'm gonna just put that in real quick and then I think that's gonna be it for this week okay. so okay so my friend and her daughter are gonna come and hang out for the weekend and then we're gonna go to the concert which will be awesome Whoop, there we go so unfortunately I do have to work at my main job on that Saturday but that's okay um, they will they'll have you know they're gonna have their vehicle here so and they've been to town a million times so they'll either just hang out until one o'clock or they'll go out and do something and then i can join them for the rest of the day so yeah the ludicrous concert was kind of like a last minute thing okay and then last thing i need to put in my chiropractic appointments i'm pretty sure was it yeah wednesday and friday Little skinny event stickers. I've got way too much Chrissy and Designs, but I guess one can never have too much Chrissy and Designs in their life. Okay, so I don't know. Let's let's do green. Okay, what is it? Seven forty-five. All right, nice. All right, let's put my videos back in here, and then I am all done. I'm pretty sure. There's always something I forget, but whatever. Um, so yeah, that is going to be it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Sorry for the nasaliness and all that good jazz, but I wanted to get this up for you guys so I didn't miss a Monday since I will be out of town. If you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up just to let me know that you liked it. And then also feel free to subscribe. I do videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And I hope that you guys are having a fabulous day wherever you are. And I will talk to you all in my next video. Bye, guys.